looks a bit like the dance of the sugar plum fairies, if they were made of water and propylene glycol. That's the key. Each droplet is composed of two fluids. The coloring is just to help you see what's going on. The different fluids evaporate at different rates and they have different surface tension. And the result in each droplet is kind of a constant internal tornado. Scientists at Stanford found that if that internal tornado is disrupted, then the droplets chase each other around, or form a line, or even climb vertically. And the reason is that just a hint of evaporation from one drop changes the relative humidity near the surface of the other drop. The change in humidity affects how water evaporates from the other drop. That changes its internal tornado, and the drop starts to move. The result is totally fun to look at, and it could be a brilliant teaching tool. Simple materials, complicated physics. <laughs>